So today we are going to draw a flamingo. And to start our flamingo, we're going to start with his head and we're going to kind of create a number two. So what we're going to do is we're going to start towards the top of our page and make a curve and then come down towards the left and then we're going to go up for his back. Now that looks kind of hard but it also looks kind of like a fancy L. So the next thing we're going to do is we are going to kind of create his head so we make a little loop. And then we're going to make his neck. So we're just going to kind of create a line right next to the other line and kind of form his shape. So now we're going to kind of create an eye shape. So we're going to take his neck down and then we're going to go round it off to his tail feather. And then you can connect them if they don't match. And then right here we're going to add his feathers and let's give him an eye and a beak so we're going to connect his nose here and their beaks go downwards and then come back up you can put a line in the middle oh, I didn't grab and get in the middle there there you go Get a little crooked beak. And then for his legs, we're going to write, do a straight line here. And then put another straight line right next to it. And then we're going to create an angle line. So like one leg's bent and another line right next to it. So it's getting little lines. And then we're going to cross over this line. However, we're going to skip and hop over. So we're going to go across your page and then you're going to go over the line and then you're going to do the same thing. So you're going to go over and then hop over and then connect it. So I'm going to give him a little foot, a little flamingo foot. And then this one's actually in the water so we're going to make a circle around but don't touch your foot. And then another circle around like he's standing in the water. And then we're also going to create the line behind them. So we're going to start from, one par start from the edge of your paper and we're going to go to your flamingo. Whoop. Don't cross them. And then hover your pencil over and then go towards the other side of the page. So there's a flamingo. So you can add stuff in the background if you want to. I'm going to add some like little trees here. And I'm going to paint them in different colors. All right, so I am going to trace them over with Sharpie and I'm going to paint them and you're going to see his finished product.